do you have a shortcut to your desktop for your documents folder? A lot of people don't, and that's a failure, I think, on Windows 7 to assume that everyone knows where their documents are hiding. So let's not make that assumption. Let's assume that you don't know where your documents are hiding and you would like to be able to access them quicker. Well, as you can see, I have a shortcut to where my documents are located. If I double left click with my mouse, it immediately opens my world to my documents. First of all, all the folders that are on my computer in the My Documents folder, and more importantly, the documents we tend to work on when we goof around. Word documents, PowerPoint, Excel, things of that nature. Sometimes photos even get put in here, but that's another story for another day. Right now, we're concerned about Microsoft Word documents and other PowerPoint, and uh, sorry, <laughs> other Office documents such as PowerPoint and Excel. So let's make sure you have a shortcut to your documents folder on the desktop like this. I've actually renamed mine my documents, but how did it get there? Easy. If I double left click with my mouse on my computer or the computer icon, I can see over here under libraries um, the different areas that are un in my computer's library, including documents. If I want to create a shortcut to any one of these things, it's quite quick and quite easy. If I right click with my mouse on documents while the little hand appears there, I can simply go copy and click with my left mouse when the drop down list displays as it just did. So I'm going to click with my left, left mouse, copy. I'm going to close this. And if I right click anywhere on a blank part of the screen, watch what happens. It gives me another drop down list and it says paste shortcut. Left mouse click, you're done. Oh wait, we have, we're not done yet. We could also name it like I did with my documents. Say your name's uh, Doug. We're going to call your, your documents folder Doug's documents. How do I do it? How do we do it? We're going to hold the mouse over that. That's the left mouse. And we can either hit the F2 on our standard keyboard and it will start to display differently like that. And if we don't want to hit F2 on our keyboard, right click, go down to where it says rename on the drop down list, click with your left mouse, rename, start typing Doug's documents and hit the enter key. You're done. And if we double click left mouse on the documents folder, there we are. All our documents easy to find right on the desktop. Can't beat that for simplicity.